All right, guys, welcome back to Finger Lakes Outdoorsman. We're out here on Honey Oil Lake today. See if we can get into some good uh, bluegills. With my special guest over here. Hi, everybody. Let's see if we can't get into them. Just gonna fall in. All right, let's see. All right, we're gonna go over to the other side. See if we can't uh, see what's going on under some docks. All right, guys, I think we got something. What do we got? Oh, shit. I hope these batteries are waterproof. All right, nice bluegill. That's a nice one. Okay. Boy, trying to get it out of here is going to be a nightmare. Okay. First bluegill of the day. Let's see what we can do next. Honeyway Lake's kind of a tough one to fish because it's really seaweedy. He might have taken the worm. I'll have to check it. Someone in there is afraid of that kayak. She thinks she's going to tip over. Okay, let's see. And they took the worm. So let's uh, rig up another one. Okay, drop it back down there. My GoPro battery fell in the water, so hopefully I can catch it. I mean, hopefully it'll still work. I don't really want to buy a new one. Let's see if we can't get onto another one. We're kind of drifting here, which isn't good. Ah, hooked myself. And he took my worm. Send it back down there. Let's see if we can't get him this time. Ah, gotta be kidding. All right, we are hooked up on something here. Whatever it is, pretty good one. Holy smokes. Look at that bluegill. That's a big giant one. That's definitely a honey white bluegill right there. You know, you can really uh, tell a honey white bluegills when they're that big. Okay, he's staying with us. up on a worm see if we can't get six of those and we'd be in business okay I'd like that they're definitely hitting right here I think we might be right off the weed line right next to the boat where they're hitting See him? I don't know if you can see it. Just something small playing with it there. Let's see if we can't get another big one. I got so much water in my boat, they think it's the lake again. Okay. Send it over again. They're literally right here. Something messing with it. I think I might be better putting a better hook on there. All right. Switching it up to the classic hook because those ones just aren't working. Okay guys, let's see if we, oh, we got another one. Okay, he's a little smaller, but hey, gotta catch some small ones if you wanna get into some big ones. Okay, let's see if we can get another one. 
All right. Whoa, Jesus. He came flying. Must be good we got into the school of them. I think it was the hook that we were having trouble with the first time. Send it back out. Okay. One's a little better. Probably put him back though. Maybe we'll send it out there a little. Maybe something better is out there. Probably not. Okay. Apparently they're all right by the boat. That one ain't so bad himself, but not quite big enough. Let's see if something's over here. And there is. Hope you guys enjoying the bluegill fishing. A lot of dinky ones, for sure. Guess we gotta put some more bait on there. Okay, send it back down. See if we can't get one. Man, they're all so dinky. Might as well use these things for bait. Okay. Try out a little further. Dragonfly on my bobber. It's interesting. Uh, we're getting something here. See if something good will take it. I ended up hooking myself. Oh Jesus, now I got the paddle. Tell me how you get the paddle. Okay, back out there. See if we can't get one more. Right in this spot. Nothing over. Oh, geez. Apparently, I do got something. Okay. Alright, guys. I hate to do it, but I'm going to have to put this guy back. I only caught one big one, so. Well, so much for the underwater release for that one. Well, thanks for watching another episode of Finger Lakes Outdoorsman. Hope to catch you next time.